youth entertainment welcomes everyone Are subscribe our channel for latest video and also click on bell icon for latest notification we're going to present about digestive system so let's learn about human digestive system before that you sus subscribe our channel for latest video so let's know about digestion the breakdown of macromolecule food into small molecule and turn it into energy and vast product called digestion. The food is a mixture of nutrient substances taken in various forms such as carbohydrate, fat, vitamins, protein, minerals, water and roughage. The digestion process takes place in gastrointestinal tract or that is also called elementary canal. The elementary canal is made up of oral cavity, pharynx, oesophagus, stomach, small intestine and large intestine. It also includes accessories, organs such as teeth, tongue, salivary gland, liver, gallbladder and pancreas. There are six primary processes of digestive system that is ingestion of food, it means that to take food, secretion, it means that some digestive gland secrete many type of enzyme, mixture and movement means the chewed food take place as a movement, digestion, digestion of food into smaller pieces. Digestion process turning large pieces of food into small component. Absorption. Absorption is necessary. Absorption begins in the stomach with simple molecule like water alcohol being absorbed directly into bloodstream. Excision. The excision of waste in process known as defecation. Defecation remove indigestible substance from the body. Next, let's come to know about oral cavity. Oral cavity is also called buccal cavity. It contains necessary organs such as tongue, teeth, salivary gland. The food is chewed by grinders. Tongue pushes the food towards the grinder and helps in mixing saliva. Saliva is secreted by three pair of salivary gland that is submaxillary, sublingual, and parotid gland. Saliva is slightly acidic. It contain mucus and digestive enzyme, tylene or salivary mylase. Tylene at Shaven pH hydrolyzes starch into maltose. Protein and fat remain undigestible in buccal cavity. Let's come to know about pharynx. Pharynx selling force the chewed food through the tubular entrance to oesophagus in form of bolus. Oesophagus. The oesophagus is 25 cm long muscular tube connecting to pharynx to stomach. Stomach. The stomach is muscular stretchable sac that is located on the left side of the abdominal cavity just inferior to the diaphragm. The average of stomach can hold about 1.5 gallon of food at liquid at maximum capacity. It holds only for 3 to 5 hours. The stomach starts chemical digestion of protein. HCL Many type of enzymes are there like that HCL changes the food from alkaline to acidic and destroy the bacteria present in food. HCL convert proranin in renin and also casein to renin and paracasein that convert into calcium paracasinate and in presence of pepsin it converts into proteoses, peptones and polypeptides. Small intestine. The small intestine is long, thin tube about 1 inch in diameter and about 20 feet long, that part of the lower gastrointestinal tract. This is located just inferior to the stomach and take up the most spaces in the abdominal cavity. Large intestine. This is long, thick tube about 2.5 inch in diameter and about 5 feet long. Liver and gallbladder. The liver is roughly triangular accessory organ of the digestive system located in the right of the stomach. And pancreas, the pancreas is large gland located just inferior and posterior to the stomach. It is about 6 inches long and shaped like leaf.